Moving over now, over now to the receive of the audio line PT340, which has come in from another dealer. Um, it is receiving, as you can hear. So we'll just go through the uh, lineup and see how, it, how well it's working. Well, it's not working brilliantly. That's 0.3 of a microvolt, and we've lost it. So we'll start tuning it up on at 1 microvolt on the test set. As ever, I'm using a Synad meter and an oscilloscope here to affect these uh, adjustments. We keep the signal generator output as low as possible, and as the radio improves, you back off the attenuator on the signal generator, as ever. And first uh, receive adjustment. I'm, I'm just looking at my notes here. I not only have the service manual, but I have a crib sheet of notes. Is, is RX1 is there? We'll do this the other way around. So that's six, which is L one, L two. L4 Sounds like it was in totally the wrong position, doesn't it? L5 Six and then the detector we've set the signal generator to 100 microvolts output, so we've got an S9 signal and adjust L19, which is the detector. I'll just put the other screen on and move my head in the light. We're looking for maximum audio on L19. Gain diffraction there. Whilst we've got that signal on, and I haven't finished, I'm going to go through those adjustments again. Um, we need to just set the S meter while I've got an S9 signal on it. I may as well. Signal meter shows S4. So we'll just adjust that for its variable resistor to 1 which is just there, so we've got S9, that looks to be S9, yep, now I'll go back to the tuning again, that's one microvolt, I'd like to hear it at point three. We're not getting that yet. So we'll go through it all again. They are interactive, so you know 
this is why I have to go to them several times. I'll just go back to the first one again. Back the signal generator off. Okay, having tuned that now meticulously three or four times, we'll now go for the squelch. So we'll turn the signal generator off and then we'll set the squelch on the radio to threshold. So switch the signal generator back on. Coming on about one microvolt, I'd like it more sensitive than that. And the squelch adjustment is number two, I think, on these. That could be dirty. Start again, signal generator off, radio to threshold, generator on. It's coming in at one microvolt, which is fine. Set the squelch to full, not the volume. And adjust the attenuator on the signal generator, it comes in at 100 microvolts, that's absolutely ideal. So there we have it, that is now fully set up and ready to go back to the dealer and hopefully pass that on to his customer. So there we have it, the audio line PT340. Doing on the air test with it. And there we are.